He's trained celebrities from Derek Huff and Shawn Mendes to Olympian Gabby Douglas. And he's a firm believer that a total transformation is as much spiritual as it is physical. So joining us today is celebrity fitness trainer and author of the new book, Seven Sundays, Alec Penix. Thank you. Well, Thank well, you for well, me. Well, welcome back. So what are you up to? Tell us about your new book. Yeah, well, Seven Sundays is a 43-day journey that's not exclusive to exercise, diet, and nutrition, but also includes a cool element of strengthening your spirit. So I'll have uh, the reader go out into the community and do cool things to contribute in a bigger way, and also asking the reader to uh, do spiritual exercise that brings us to a deeper introspection of who we are, to bring the, the, the awareness of the emotional wounds that we've been dealing with to sort of strengthen those. So it's, it's a book that just uh, doesn't just strengthen the, the, the body, but also strengthens the spirit side. Simultaneously. So I guess doing charitable work, you've, you've done some yourself and you find the true benefit spiritually of helping others and what it does to just make you feel better about yourself. Yeah, I, I tell the, the quickest way to get out of depression is, is to give back. It put, automatically puts us in a state of gratitude and it shifts everything. And we also see things in contrast. We see people who are really struggling and actually say, well, Maybe I'm not, maybe my life is not that bad after all. Exactly. And, and I'm told that you were bullied as a child because you had a learning disability. Yes, yeah, so when I was, I was diagnosed with a learning disability and then I was bullied a lot in school. Mm -hmm. And because uh, I was younger, I sort of adopted this, this self-image of that I wasn't worthy, that I wasn't smart. And I carried this with me my entire life until one day, uh, that day was when I was was saved and found God and, and because of this new walk of faith I was able to start to break free from that old identity and start making a new one for myself how because God created us in his image That's what I believe in and I think we all are and so I was starting to tap into that and that's when we started seeing the whole potential yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, I think we're doctors and we're, we're all about healing and wellness. The, I think the spiritual component of that is, is yeah. underplayed. And I, I, think, I think what you're, what you're suggesting is it truly is a powerful healing agent. Yes. So, yes. so, and I know you're, you're incorporating that into your, yeah. your program. I guess you, you have what you call the three pillars it's, of this well, program. It, uh, there, there, it's actually the six pillars of promise. It's, and then you can break it up into two elements. Uh, you have the spiritual side, which is, stands for conceding, honoring, and offering. Uh, then you have the physical, which stands for sleep, nutrition. And we also have exercise, which I think you guys want to do a little circuit today. Is it, yeah. yeah, you guys want to. We're going to let you do that. We're not, we're not <laughs> dressed for it either way. No, no. Uh, Okay, we're you know what? That. You're can't do it now. We're, we're with you spiritually, though. <laughs> well, our I can feel your presence. Our spirit is there 100% on board.